Um, you you need to have success on the mat. You've mentioned all the other you know great um, attributes that you're looking for people, but you're here to be the coach and and help somebody transition into that as well, right? Yeah. So talk to me a little bit about academics here at Sacred Heart. I'm not, I, I don't know much about the, this institution. We've got graduation going on today. Yeah. <laughs> what, what's academic life like here? Oh, it's very busy. It's very demanding. Um, they do try to help uh, student athletes as much as they can. You know, you can have uh, your, your schedule. You can really um, work around your practice time. Um, I have a privilege of um, reserving block of classes during practice time so my kids never have classes scheduled during practice which is awesome uh, i can't do the same for the weightlifting but then we have makeup lifts with our strength and condition coach so they never miss um, there is lots of free resources we've got free tutors uh, free lab centers uh, we've got a writing uh, center so you can basically like, submit your paperwork and they will try to pre-review and you know help you with grammar and stuff like that they really want you to succeed. Um, they do demand a lot. You know, you cannot miss classes. You cannot not do work because uh, you will fail. Uh, but they don't want you to fail. They want you to succeed. And you know, just even for student athletes, we have a um, student support system, which is actually upstairs in this uh, athletics building that we are in. Uh, and every team has an assigned liaison from student support. They make sure that we stay on top of, you know, towards graduation, that GPA is good, we don't fall behind. They really do um, help a lot. Uh, I, on my end, I require study hall hours uh, from my athletes. Sometimes, you know, there will be people who will study no matter what, but there are people who need that structure mm -hmm. and, you know, they will just get the, the job done then, so.